the Into the Kingdom retreat came in about, I think it was about a year ago we heard we were going to do this retreat in Holland and um, that it was going to be the biggest retreat we'd ever done. And since that point, I've been involved in, in it the whole way along. But actually, um, in the last few weeks, I feel like, I was saying this at lunch with the group here the other day, I feel like it's just starting to take over my full mind. Like Jesus is so strongly underneath this retreat that it's, um, it's actually the whole center here is in full support of it. And I just feel like there's something um, so huge about this retreat. I can feel like even symbolically, the size of it, it's going to be a week-long um, retreat from October 7th to 13th, um, a week-long residential retreat in a castle. We're all going to be living together. Um, it's going to be us here from the Spain Center going over. Um, David, uh, Kirsten, Francis are going to be flying from Mexico in the US. Fava is going to be there sharing her, her beautiful songs. And it's like, it's just this this coming together and I feel like such a, a deep, deep prayer for opening up and for healing and I know that actually this retreat is the answer to that prayer for so many and with, I think that there's going to be about 200 of us there for this week and that shared prayer of coming together, that shared intention of healing, it's like that is so honoured by the Spirit and everything is just going to be orchestrated so that your prayer is answered in that and yeah we have so many amazing gifts i don't even know where to start with what's already come in with what's going to be part of that retreat one huge beautiful gift is that um francis sue's uh, documentary um, take me home is going to be showed and um it hasn't been released yet and I think it will be a while before the documentary is released but we are going to have a private viewing of that with um, Frances herself there and some of the members of the of the cast you know here behind the camera we have Soren who's a beautiful star in this documentary um, and yeah I could just share a little bit of of my experience when I saw that documentary a few months ago, Frances, when she was in Spain, she showed it to us here and um, I had like, yeah, this profound experience where like I felt like my heart burst open and it was actually watching Sarah's. <laughs> <Can't look in. laughs> Yeah, it was um, it was watching Sarn because at the beginning of the of the movie, like Sarn was actually very shut down and just found it very very difficult to be able to not only express his feelings but to get in touch with them. There was like so many layers, and through the course of this month, when the documentary was being filmed, everything that happened, it seemed to be that he was on a team making a documentary but that wasn't what was really happening actually it was an unwinding in the mind that was happening on a very very deep level and there was a scene at the end of the movie where uh, Saren just you know shared his his love for Francis and was just so vulnerable and I think he said something about I, I feel I feel ridiculous and when he shared that I just like my heart cracked open and I don't even know why I don't know what it was but something about the purity and the depth of the healing and I just I just know for for everyone who's seen the movie because it was shown at um, the A to L retreat in, at the monastery recently and I know it touched so many people so deeply that it is um, it's not just watching a movie you actually come into an experience of the profound healing that's happening in the mind and I know that this is a gift from the spirit that has come through Francis and everybody who's in this documentary just to to bless everyone and to meet the mind exactly where it's at and Jesus knows how to reach the mind and there are so many so many tools that are going to be available at this retreat for that it, 
you know, the documentary. Also, Netta Boyne is going gonna, is gonna to be there and uh, doing voice liberation workshop um, throughout the whole week. And Netta and I did a voice liberation workshop last year um, at the monastery. And it was, yeah, just very, very heart opening for everybody who was part of that. Um, somehow, through Netta, it's her gift is using the voice to open the heart, whether it's through her beautiful songs and singing, or whether it's working with people in these either large groups or small groups, and just listening so clearly to the spirit in the moment and just zooming into exactly what's needed to bypass the in intellect and just to crack the heart open. Whatever is in the deep recesses of the mind, that there's no other way for it to be revealed. Something with using the voice in this way just penetrates right through. And it'll be an opportunity for you to be able to ask the deepest questions of your heart. And I would just, you know, if you're coming or you feel a spark in your heart to come, I would just, you know, put that prayer out now. What is it? spirit that I am ready to have lifted from my mind and and I can tell you the the into the kingdom retreat does not start on October 7th it starts from when you say yes and I know that's true because I have said yes and I'm feeling every day the healing that's happening just in that and I just know that miracles are going to happen and I know in in my heart um, my yeah my deep prayer is for healing and undoing and I, I just invite you all into that and I want to be joined with you in it. So if you feel that spark in your heart, please come. I'll give you a big hug when you arrive. And yeah, I love you all. Thank you.